Greetings, I am Lies. Ah, and I, I am Scandal. Hello, Louisa. And let's, let's play, play a game together. together. I mean, I... let's just play a game together. Oh my god. All right, so uh, welcome let's aboard. Do it. We are in a choice because we ran into it <clears throat> at the end of the last game. And I really do. I think we're going to wish for Rena to the get better. Game. By the last game. The last God, episode. I feel oh, like sorry. years, <laughs> years go by in between episodes because, like, damn, it's it, such an effort sometimes. It feels like, actually, this game has just taken, like, 900 years to play. And the, the only reason we're still going is because we are stubborn as hell. We're like, we will finish one version of a game for boys, okay? Well, we'll do we're it. do it. This is what men apparently like, according to this particular marketing and writing team, and we're going we're gonna to try it on. Which is probably not entirely accurate, based off of... What I understand, actually, with how grossly, at least the United States politics, can basically grossly underestimate or overestimate certain things. The interest completely. parties, yeah, okay. Yeah, I... I wish for Rena to get better. <sighs> yes, she needs to heal, even though she's not sick anymore, because they said she made a massive step in her recovery. But I just need her out of the ICU, because it's not fair that I don't get to see her all the time. She's been here for so long. She needs to see the outside world. Oh, please, oh, please let her see the outside world once more. That's so, that's so generic. Not like, you know, play in a playground or go back to school or, or just be go... with her mom and live at home. How about her just healing? Going outside doesn't mean see she's... See the outside world. I mean, she's allowed her... to leave the hospital. Poink looks out the window. I have seen it, guys. Hi. Congratulations. I did I it. I have now seen it. Yay. Yay. That was kind of cute, though. I... I take a deep breath. And I blow the candles. <laughs> I shove them. Because, you know, when they're really big candles like that, and you're uh -huh. going to shove them in your face, you really have to hold your breath for it. So I, I breathe in first. Yeah. All right, we blow the candles. The flames go out in one puff. Whoa. I throw I... my head into it so hard that just the gust of air blows out the other two candles while I just mow down on the first one, and it just, my saliva puts that one out. Ah, hey, and I realize that this one's made out of candy. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Everyone claps their hands. Okay, they nod their heads. They clap their hands. What else are they going to clap? Their ass cheeks? Clap the clap of their ass cheeks because they're all dummy thick. Ooh! Okay. I, <clears throat> oh, you got them all in just one blow. Mister's mouth expands. <laughs> just to get all the Mister, cheeks. you know what's great? They were narrow, so I just put all four in my mouth at once. Blech. <laughs> Tongue in the middle. We got this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That wish is certainly going to come true. I've never seen anyone deep throat candles with that much enthusiasm. Oh, I sure and I'm hope a succubus. So. so, damn, boy. And I'm a remember, concubus. Remember how I said you were amazing and distinctive and special? That was pretty special. I know. Wow, that's <laughs> Louisa. special. Ooh. Louisa, ooh. I'm going to take notes. I would take notes. You know what? Did you just locate your jaw for that? Wow. Wow. Uh, You're learning something somehow. Or you knew that. Did you know that coming in? <gasps> we could have been using that this whole time. Is this secretly a I fucked the entire football team? Or excuse me, the entire soccer team? The entire sport team? Before I could go down on three guys at once. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that was the big um, of this game. I sure, I sure, I sure hope so. I brilliant. I hope I could do the whole soccer team. Oh at once. God! Now, are you ready for more? More uh, chewing on one of the candy candles. Num num num. num, num. Eating il eating a literal dick. Eat a dick. Uh, num, 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 num. Uh, wait. What? You mean it's not over yet? I get to eat the cake it's, too? It's not yet over. Oh, sorry. It's not yet over. That's so. Louisa so... giggles. <laughs> Of course not, silly. There are more surprises in store for our favorite patient. Oh. I'm going to suck your eyeballs out of your head. Oh, I'm sorry. Erotic eyeball licking. <laughs> <laughs> but for now, we're just going to enjoy eating the cake and playing some party games. All five of us? Yeah. Do you think we can all fit in my bed? Yeah. Oh, hi. Oh. Louisa, you know, you just spoiled the surprise. Oh, dang it. Did someone say cake? <gasps> I have to be the one who has food issues and is always pointed out to be eating too much or being un eating unhealthy. So cake for me. Hooray. Oh, ho, ho, ho. 
Only the best cake that comes from my kitchen. Absolutely. That is the only kind of cake I ever want to eat. Get over here. Yes. Uh, games? I want to play games. I want to win. I want to win. Murder! I will kill you all. Oh, wow. Granny Baba sure is competitive today. Well, don't we love a good spirit of competition? Let's begin the celebration. Hang on. Cake and candles and blowing ah. the candles was was not the celebration? <laughs> I am so confused. <laughs> and then we eat and play to our heart's content. The the, the I, hearts that is belong to to all of us. The hearts belong to content. What? It is the content, content that the content belongs to the heart to our heart's content. That <clears throat> the content does belong to your hearts. Okay. The I... cake tastes amazing and the games are so much fun. So they all accommodate for me either in my bed or in my wheelchair. It's so really thoughtful. Just so much fun. My friend's not going to survive this. So I need to add more entertainment somewhere. Somehow it's going to happen. <laughs> yeah, so in much. fact, I've never had so much fun on my birthday before. Like my Usually, parents never gave me chocolate before this point mm -hmm. because it would normally, they said it would kill me. And we never. I'm actually secretly Willy Wonka. Done and, as done by Timber. <laughs> and and we've never done anything for my birthday that was fun or interesting ever. Normally, I just got a good old chuck on the shoulder saying, Hey, you didn't die for another year. And then my dad went back to law college. Yeah, and, and then I think something about, like, a belt. I I don't remember. Usually I get socks for my birthday. Oh, nice. It's the only time I ever got socks. Oh, I got ties one year. No, that was Christmas. That was a special occasion. Oh, dang, I forgot. It was just Christmas. But the only reason I've never had fun on my birthday is because my parents die every year on my birthday. Because that's the only way to have a good tragic backstory. Really? But, you know, they can't just have it once because it has to be tragic every year. And that's just the only story we can come up with. So it just happens the same every year. It's beautiful. I, I... just get, like, adopted every year and then my parents die again oh great instead of having it be like the problem where you know you just have like this bad reoccurrence over and over again you have <laughs> this kid that their tragic story is they're always in the adoption system because every time they get adopted their parents just die horribly in completely unrelated incidents they've lost like seven sets of parents by uh -huh. the time they're 12 everybody going Whoa. We're never going to adopt that Everyone child. else going, no, it won't happen again. Do not adopt this child. No, no, we can do it. We are fine. Dies. And the thing is, is everyone is compelled to do so. It's wild. Yep, you like the curse of me. In I... fact, I've never so had so much fun. I will remember this morning for the rest of my life. My whole... However long that is. Wait. I... A new room. Holy shit. Whoa. After the celebration, Luisa and Miki asked me to go to the audio room. What the hell is the audio room? It looks like an office room. You've got a tea set over here, a blender. This looks like an employee lounge or something like that. I mean, those, yeah. Yeah, that's I... a tea set. That's like a blender slash so tiny mini radiator? Trophy. Yeah, that looks like a heater, actually. This one's like a vase. Uh -huh. You got a copy machine, you got an, uh, an electric stapler. Like, damn, bro. Like, this is a, this isn't, office but there's a huge ass tv in it that doesn't mean that it's a oh my god okay no this mind. is wild luisa and miki asked me to go to the audio room audio it's just me and them oh boy in this room and me and my dick um, still eating luisa why do you need me here i right here oh dear it's another surprise they just keep on coming right, right? I position myself in front of a white screen that is not on here at all. Honestly, this almost looks like it's got like a lab experience going on here. Mm -hmm. Like it's an office and lab because you've got this sort of, uh, you know, glass door refrigerator thing. Right. Like, damn. I say, or that could be a glass cabinet with like media inside it. So it's more like a media room than an audio room. But wow. Right. A white screen. Louisa presses a button on a projector. We got video of all of your dead parents. All of them. Oh, all of them. A short clip begins to play, because I know it's short because there's a timestamp in the corner. Right. Whoa, look, it's my friends. You have friends? I... Since when? I forgot the outside world existed. The video shows my soccer teammates, who I have canonically said are not my friends, and I don't want to get anywhere near them, all cheering me on. Oh, we missed you, mister. Please walk again. Yeah, you don't walk. Our tournament is doomed. 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 Doom. 
We be- patient too. I oh no, the patients are back. We believe on you, Mister Ditch the Wheelchair. Now, no, all teammates. Happy birthday! Go go go! Fight fight fight! You dropped a go. There's I don't three. care. I added fight down instead because that's how it works. Nobody's like coordinated. Go fight! Go fight! Go fight! Fight go! Then they show a large banner that says "Happy Birthday, <gasps> Mister." Great! I love it. The clip ends. And Louisa is immediately in front of my vision. Whoa. Uh, Louisa turns off the projector. So, how do you like my surprise? You went out and contacted all my team members and asked them to say happy birthday to me on my birthday for my birthday present? Yes. Wow, I didn't Amazing. know you could leave the hospital. That's really important. No, but remember, I live in that little house down by the bay that's so tropey. Oh, I forgot. Alone, were you, without a daddy. Were, were you the one who shot the video? Did you film it? I did. I had to go to your school and assemble the Avengers. I mean, your teammates. I bet they loved seeing you in your nurse outfit walking down the halls in the school. They might have. You never know. You they... probably looked amazing behind that camera. Oh, God. I did. It was hard work, but it was worth it. Wrangling all those boys while they were just ogling you and your clothes <laughs> and the fact that you're the hottest nurse ever except for the other one? I'm, I'm glad. <laughs> oh, gosh. Thank you so much for the effort. Thank you so much for willing to be objectified so hard, except for I don't know what that word is. Uh, uh, Louisa. So, what are you feeling now that you've seen the clip? Yeah. Uh, how should I answer that? I don't know. She sounds more breathy than usual. <laughs> more, more flustered. I think she was nervous about the clip, but I liked it. How, what do I feel about Louisa's clip? I... What do I feel? Uh, I'm now more determined to walk again. You can't get much more determined. Hi. You, every time anyone says anything, you're more determined to walk again. Don't and worry. And you swear you're going to walk He's again. He's a shonen And you hero. promise you're going to walk again. It will happen. And you assure yes. everyone you will and walk you again. And you assert And you're going to just... it's going to happen. I will absolutely walk again. <laughs> it's fine. No, That's I, fine. I'm now, I'm now more determined, determined to, to walk, walk again. again. More determined than 100% even. I am now more determined to walk again. My team's message ignited the fire within me. I know. And staring at you just keeps it burning. Louisa seems pleased. I'm glad you feel that way. That is exactly what I want you to get from my video. She still sounds really breathy. I wonder if she's been working really hard. Maybe she's really tired. I should tell her to get some rest. Again. I appreciate it so much. I appreciate you don't this. have to work so hard. Miki uh, clears her throat. Ahem. It's time for my surprise, which will be better than her, her surprise. surprise. Honestly, one of my favorite surprise ones, and what was so dorky, was when all three of the dragon princes decided to try and impress Small and surprise her on the exact same day. Oh, God. And they were yeah. just trampling the flowers in her room and stuff, and they're all whining that you can't surprise her. I was surprising her. It was it was very funny. Honestly, that was more entertaining than, than this. That series had a lot more in it. Like, we thought that it wasn't great at the time, but, like, the more of these games we play, the more we <clears> realize <throat> that the bar just keeps getting lower. The bar? Uh, but anyway, oh, um, My Messy Dragons is a, is a pretty cute series based on this experience. Huh. It's time for my surprise. <gasps> what? You have a surprise too? Whoa. Whoa! I chew on more of, of my dick. Of course. I still eating the dick candle. Num, <laughs> num, 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 num. I didn't think... Of course. You didn't uh, Didn't think I would do nothing for you, did you? Nothing Even though for you. I'm not going to do nothing for you, which means I have to do something for you. Even though something. I organized the entire thing, and all of it was credited to me <laughs> in your room this morning. Um, you didn't think I was going to do nothing, did, did you? you? Miki picks up a soccer ball from under a table and gives it to me. Oh, wow! Written on the ball are signatures of different people, as well as not, I mean, God, it's so generic. Different people, not the same person over and over again. It just says John Wayne 400 times. <laughs> just, oh my God. Um, and motivational messages. And I found 900 John Waynes. Like, this is a really cute idea, honestly. Oh, yeah, like, it's, it's very, actually kind of thoughtful. Very charming and thoughtful, but I'm just like, of different people, not of like my friends, my family, people from the hospital. Like, it's just so generic. Yeah. 
<clears throat> I read some of the messages written on the ball. I read the ball. I, I read ball. Stare into the ball. Happy birthday. Please walk again so we can have an unforgettable game. This is all they care We about. want battle. We Mister want needs battle. to play. Sorry, we want a battle. In, in case you still haven't noticed, that's the handwriting of your opponent. I went even further. The opposing team, orchestrated by myself, and there's some kid on there named Ken that was really enthusiastic about you. I don't know. Um, They really want to fight against you. They feel like your team is shit without you on it. Which is really... I went over to their school and got their signatures. So whatever work she did is not as good as mine. Because I, I had to went face the distance. And I had to face the enemy. Your enemy. Mm -hmm. It was amazing. You went I over? got all of their signatures in the back. You went over to my rival team school? Wow. Did you see Ken? Casually turns the ball to see if Ken's signature is on Hi. there. I feel... I feel... Yes? So? How does the surprise make you feel? What should I tell her? Panic. I'm now more motivated to beat that team. I don't think I'm good enough to beat that team. Those are that the only really options, easy. but that's really easy. I'm now more motivated to beat that team. They even say they want me to. There's one on here saying, please beat me, mister, with a little heart. Clearly they want me to defeat them on the team. Yeah! Um, sure. Sure, mister. I just, that's Lisa. exactly what it yep. is beating you. Yes. Plow me into the dirt, mister. You bet I will. Right on that field. Like, exactly uh, like I blew, blow those candles. You betcha. Oh, yes. As soon as you can walk, you can show them what it takes to rise from the dead. Beat them, mister. <clears throat> Beat them all. We'll give you a flog on your next birthday. Oh, my God. This is so tiring. I... You bet I will, and I am the one who's gonna score that winning shot. I'll yeah! get it right in there. It'll be amazing. It'll happen. I just bam, I'll, pregnant. I'll aim perfectly, and all those boys on the other team, they'll just fall uh, right down. Oh God! All right, they'll be ready for you. What? No, they'll be finished. Uh, right. I love the determination from you. That's what we want to hear. I, I'm i glad. I wish we had this level of energy on every episode because um, sometimes we're just tired. I genuinely... <laughs> Thank you so much, Miki, for this wonderful gift. You're welcome. I'm glad you like my gift more. Aww. <laughs> Likes it more, but Miki, Mister didn't say he liked it more than my gift. Oh, now the cattiness not... starts. Yeah, here comes Here the we cats. go with the toxic masculinity. Of uh, toxic, I guess femininity. femininity. That's maybe? toxic femininity. Yeah, okay, that's fine. But I'm talking about toxic masculinity in the sense of reinforcing that. I, that we are. We are actually doing the the women will fight fight for your affection. Yep. yep. Isn't that right, Mister? Oh, uh, huh. Um. Well. I joyous, offended. Also, I love that Miki never puts down her clipboard, no matter what. Yeah, no kidding. Well, I'm, well, I'm assuming that Mr. likes my gift more. It's not every day you see a rival team wishing him good luck. And I had to work harder for it. That school's farther away, and those people didn't all know that he was here. I... Hmm. <sighs> Oh, but what matters more is the entire team, right? The teammates are more important than the opponents. Yo, uh, there's no need to fight. But they aren't listening to me. Not anymore. Let's just ask Mr., shall we? This is so much that moment from Doki Doki Literature Club. Oh my God. Monica has seeped into another game, but it is just that trope uh. of girls fighting over you because they both want you so bad. Uh-huh. That's a good idea. Actually, he'll have to agree with one of us because there'll be no option to bow out. Brilliant. They both look at me with those definitely look like curious eyes. Okay, the face of curiosity, my friend. Oh, we will screen cap this and put it up in the um, growing my nurse girlfriend um, gallery yeah. and call it the face of curiosity. Brilliant. They both look at me with curious eyes. So, which gift do you prefer more, mister? My video clip is precious and sincere. No, the ball with the signatures is much more cooler. Much more. Much more. Cooler. Not much cooler. Much more cooler. Much more better good cooler. Yeah. Yeah. That, yeah. Mm. <laughs> Do I really need to decide? Yes! yes! Oh. Uh. I'd like to call in. I'd, I'd like to use my phone call now. I am at... I'm going to phone a friend. I really hope we have a third option because I'm just like... Oh, God.
Oh, but also, dear. that wouldn't be an it be what honest in regards to the should I do? Who should I pick? Oh, no. Flirt with them by choosing both of their gifts. That is amazing and wild. Choose Luisa's video. Okay, he would choose both. He oh. really would. He would just choose both of them because he doesn't want to upset anyone and he's been openly flirting with them now. Well, you know what? We are out of time! So we're going to have oh, to flirt with them in the, the next, next one. one. Yay! God, kill me and release me from this mortal coil. I can't believe they're going to do this with both of them. That's that's wild. Uh, Honestly, props for just going there, for finally leaning in. Yeah, finally. You know, it's only taken you, what? 70 episodes. <laughs> All right, well, thank you very much, guys, for joining us. If you like what we do, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and also share our videos if you're yep. having a good time with us. Please also feel free to check out our Ko-Fi and our Patreon. We've got some links in the description down below. And I have been scandal, yes. <laughs> and I have been lies. And, and it was, was great, great playing, playing with you. you. Goodbye. Bye.